Well, good afternoon and welcome back to the channel. This is Oliver coming to you from y'all here in Ireland over in Europe. And this is 72-2. So this is the solution from 72-1 and there's a link down below to 72-1 and to my solution of it, which was very long winded and cumbersome. I'm now looking at a solution given by Glenn Scott. So this video will be totally about his solution, which I think is going to be a lot nicer. And I also want to thank um, Ross because I was looking at Glenn's notes and I'm afraid I couldn't get anywhere. And Ross gave me a hint. And thank you very much for that, Ross, because I've never done W wings before. And now I understand them and they're quite powerful. So we're going to start off with a W wing and the W wings has a binary basically at both ends and then there has to be a strong link. I think they call them complementary pairs or conjugate pairs, conjugate pairs. So as uh, Glenn said, there's a lot of one fives. There's one five there, there's another one over here and there's one down here. So if we look at this one and this one and they're linked by this conjugate pair here of the one. So if we start off with the five, off, on, off, on, off, on. There's our link between there and there, so we can get rid of what is intersecting, which is this one here. How easy, and it took me forever to get that one, <laughs> that one rid of. And we can do exactly the same with this double one here. And you know what, I was thinking there must be something we could do with that, but I never realized what it was. Off, on, off, on, off, on. So we can get rid of this five here. And now do bear with me, I'm still a chains man. I find it very hard to get my mind around just doing a W wing as such. So um, thank you anyway for uh, showing me how to put in the chain. <laughs> right, so that's that part done. And from there, we should be able to get rid of a few things now, shouldn't we? Oh, I just know something there that I shouldn't have had in there. This is a triple two, four, five. So I shouldn't have had a five and the two in there. My mistake on that. I meant I bad. I shouldn't have had that in there. Okay. Where do we go from here now? Um, okay, we've got two trees there, uh, two ones. So that's a one three. We can get rid of that one. Give me us this five here. Lovely. I get rid of that. Oh, we get rid of a fair amount of stuff now with this, don't we? That was quite good. Uh, six gets rid of that. Any other sixes? There's a six here, which will make this one the six. This is a lot better than the way I started it. I have to admit this is very, very good, actually. Two gets rid of that one. Hmm, making this one the two. And we had one down here, didn't we? Before I forget it, the six. That'll get rid of that six, making this one the six up here. Okay. You're right then, it does clear up a fair amount. That two there, there's nothing for us up there. The one uh, gets rid of a few things here. Wow, this looks like a fairly powerful one now. Fair juice to you. And the six here, it just leaves us with a four three, a double there on the four three. And oh, I thought we got rid of something else down here. It's amazing when you're blind, you're blind. I missed out here. There's a naked one up here. And thank you for, for those people who pointed out to me. I found it all right in my old video, but I just couldn't find it this time. So there should be a one in there. Let's stick in the one now. And that'll get rid of that one and that one. And uh, Oops, let's get rid of that one altogether. And we get rid of that one, making this the one here. And that two will will do the one anyway. There must be a single two somewhere else now. Another naked one. That's the one there. And in this column, that will be our two. And in this house, that will be our five. Okay, that's going to do a fair amount. For us five, we'll get rid of that one. And this one here as well. That was decent and the two will get rid of that one nothing else over there nothing up at the top the five here gets rid of hmm nothing much and the four will get rid of that one down there and that's it we now have two fours here 
we have now we're back to where Glenn said he was are we we have a 5 8 a 4 8 and an 8 9 yes so going back now to Glenn Scott's notes at <laughs> long last caught up with you God uh, so let me have a read of this so he says that there is um, eight appears three times in this column, which he says is very unusual. Uh, appearance of any particular numbers in binary cells in any of the 27 uh, units are usually at most two. So why do we have three? I never realized that, Len. Thank you for mentioning that. It suggests a single chain. <laughs> well, once anybody mentions a chain, I get very, very interested. So let me have a look at this now. Yeah, I can see the chain because I had it in my own as well. It's a very handy little one. Oh, but before I do that, I've just noticed there is a, another <laughs> naked one up here. So we stick that one in and that get rid of that one because it was the only that that's the only one there in that row. And there's no ones down there. OK, so we're talking about these eights. And I think if we start here, yeah, we can start with this one down here. And there are that's a, a strong link there. That's the Snyder pair. So off on and I should have put this one here. There's also a strong link up there and across. So it's off, on, off, on. And this is the common one. So we can get rid of this one now. And that gives us the four. Getting rid of a few more things along here. No more fours over there. Down here we get rid of that one. And that is all that we get rid of there. The four. Just want to make sure that's it. Yeah. Okay. That was it. Actually, we're back now to ones that I had in my one. We go here, would we? Um, um, off on. We want to target this one down here. Which means we're going to finish off here and it's going to go something like, yeah, that's where it's going to go. Off on, off on, off on, off on, off on. And that means that this one here we can get rid of. That was uh, just a straight, uh, a straight AIC. Um, now he said there was a couple of chains that come in here at this stage, and I'm just trying to remember what ones that I have in my solution at the over about now. Uh, although thinking back, there was two I got rid of. Of course, you've got that one and that one, so you can also get rid of that one up there. Now, uh, yeah, that's right. And what does that give us in here? We have two threes anyway. We have two fives. Um, it's important to try and get those up to date because when you're trying to work out your chains, it's great to be able to see the uh, the black ones, especially if they're in binaries. Didn't I have one on nines then at that stage? I think I did. Um, fairly, yeah, off, on, off, on, off, on. That targets this one here. So that one goes, giving us the three. And you know what? I think that was about it, wasn't it? Three, that get rid of that one. Uh, that one, nothing else. Be careful now that you don't make a mess. One, one, no other ones. Two gets rid of that one there, giving us the eight. That two gets rid of that one, giving us a five. Lovely. We'll take the five, gets rid of that one, giving us a three. Uh, no fives over there. Up here at the top we have one, giving us a one, which we will take now. Gets rid of that one and nothing else. The three gets rid of that one and that one. And nothing else there, we've all those done. And this three here gets rid of these ones. And I seem to be running out of steam now. Uh, we have a 4848, eight. gets rid of that, that eight, giving us a two. And this is a cleaner solution than the one that I had, I think. And the eight down there, we'll get rid of that one. You must the nine and get rid of these two up here as well. Uh, seven, seven, nine, three, nine. Okay, that'll come out handily as well. Nine gets rid of that one. Uh, nothing else, no nines in there. We have a load of stuff now that we can get rid of. I think we are now finished. Five. That's going to be our five there, and that's going to be our nine. And down here, what did I have? I thought I had another one down here. Uh, this one here, four. Gets rid of that one, giving us a three. And gets rid of that one. But now this is our four, because that eight should have gone anyway. 
that four will get rid of that one giving us an eight and that eight gets rid of that one giving us a three we'll take the eight up here first and that gets rid of that the seven here gets rid of that one but also gets rid of that one giving us a five five gets rid of that one giving us an eight and any other fives no this five here won't do anything i'd say because we've everything done we've got a four nine there we shouldn't have a four nine there was the four so this should be a nine and that means this one's going to be a four this one is a nine and this one is a three getting rid of that one this nine here gets rid of that and that we have the eight giving us a seven we have an eight here uh, we have a nine and we have a three you know what then that was a much neater and nicer solution than i had and well done congratulations to you uh very good very good i enjoyed that one that was nice look um thanks for watching and len thank you very much for putting in that solution i know i also have notes here from ross and ross if you're looking at this i've, I've looked at your notes a few times and uh, i won't say they're gobbledygook but i just don't know enough about wxyz wings um I'm going to have to post up something and maybe you can help me out on that and teach me a little bit about the WXYZ and how you solved it because I'm afraid it's just beyond me. But Len, really appreciate what you've done. Uh, there will be another, um, what you call a puzzle, uh, around, around the end of this week, around Friday. I'll put that up anyway. And thanks everybody for watching and supporting me. It really gets me through many, many days. All right, I appreciate it. Uh, Jenna will and talk to you again soon. Slán